Ben, what the fuck is that? Yo, what is that? Oh, holy sh Whoa, 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 holy sh What the f What the f The death toll in this forest is in the hundreds. Yeah. Hundreds of people have died in this forest. This forest is bad news. Oh, the, the white thing in the grass scared me again. Hello? I'm t- ah! Holy shit! Oh, holy f bro! Ah, good? Yeah! Watch this up! Oh! Holy f Jazz here. It's kind of hard to see him. Yeah, what's that? Oh shit! Oh fuck! Oh f oh f oh! F Yo! What? 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 Well, I'll definitely threaten tomorrow, dude. Holy! No, oh, you can see. Holy shit! Holy shit! Holy shit! What the f is he doing? Oh! Fuck! Okay. What's up everybody welcome back to the channel welcome back to another crazy and scary video in tonight's video my friend ben and i went to this creepy haunted horrifying forest and we used this app called randonautica now for those who don't know what this app is essentially if you manifest something you use this application it's supposed to bring you along the lines of what you're manifesting right now i use this app for about three or so years and obviously with Doing horror content, people are like, well, hey, you know, if the app can bring you to chocolate cake, if that's what you're thinking about, why can't it take you to things like unsolved mysteries or, you know, things going deeper and deeper down the, I'd say horror realm, right? Sometimes people would be like, Jazz, you should manifest a triple homicide. And I'm like, w what? Like, but this is what people wanted. Not that we would ever do that, but hypothetically, that's what this app is capable of, right? So we use this in the scary forest and we had some horrifying experiences. There were people out there, they had weapons. It was one horrifying night. And a lot of people ask me why I don't do these types of videos anymore. This is a pretty good example of why we don't. <laughs> um, but yeah, this is a video from a couple of years ago, back when Ben and I first started filming together. And honestly, I'm shocked that he even stayed with me he's still filming with me to this day after what we experienced this night so just get ready for one of the craziest experiences we've ever had this was one of those videos that got buried by youtube's algorithm so a lot of you guys probably haven't even seen this video so just get ready this is an insane night that's all i'm gonna say so if you are enjoying these videos and you want to see more smash that like button subscribe to this channel if you haven't already let's get to 100,000 subscribers and with that being said Hope you guys enjoy the video. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to another Randonautica video. Ben and I are back here in this absolutely terrifying uh, forest where we found out some crazy information yeah. about the community that lives here. And we found out a lot more. There's a lot more than what we were told. There's so much beyond satanic rituals and so much beyond... So much, bro. When we told you guys a story, we told you that 15 children died here. The death toll in this forest is in the hundreds. Yeah. Hundreds of people have died in this forest. This forest is bad news. Bad it's news. Nothing but just bad vibes, bro. Bad vibes. Well, the things bad that we've vibes. experienced the past three times we've came here has been absolutely insane. We're gonna showcase that for you guys in this video. Absolutely nuts, Ben. What do you think about your experience here? You know. I look at Amish communities a little bit differently now, not in a way of like, <laughs> I know that sounds bad. I just, bro, just the things that could happen in a place that has so little going on, you know? Exactly. It's like it invites trouble, yep. you know? We talked to somebody who lives in this community and they told us the full history of this place and it is absolutely insane. It, it's actually terrifying, sent chills down my spine and we're gonna be telling you that entire story in today's video. And we're also gonna be showing you guys everything that's happened it's nuts. Yeah. It's actually nuts. It's so crazy. get ready for another crazy ass video. Ben, are you ready? Oh, 
All right. Can you be ready for this? Never. You can't be. <laughs> yeah. Well, I wanted to say, actually, we talked about this in the video, but if this video smashes 17,000 likes, Ben and I are going to be coming back here. We're going to be spending the night inside of a tent in this forest. Some will so, say we're cruising for a bruising yes. at that point. Absolutely. <laughs> point, like we're asking for some dumb shit to happen. So if you want to see me and Ben absolutely have a very terrifying night, smash that like button. 17,000 likes. We come back here and we will spend the night. You have our word. We shook on it in the video. We did. So um, with all that being said, guys, the video is about to start. Make sure to subscribe if you have not already. Also, I know this is a really poor time to do this, but it is the season of giving and I'm doing something in a completely different way. I'm going to be doing a lot in December as well, but this is for now. Uh, we just dropped our merch line. So we have a lot of stuff right now, like these natural hoodies with some logos and everything Ooh. on the back. We have shirts, long sleeve shirts, uh, everything, wristbands, windbreakers. We have a lot of stuff on the website. The link is right here and down in the description below. Every order that comes through on the merch website actually qualifies you guys for a MacBook Pro. Uh, that will be announced on the 27th of November. Literally, you could buy a wristband or whatever the hell you want, and it qualifies you. Every order counts. So, mm -hmm. with all that being said, that's that. Now, let's get back into one of the most terrifying nights of our lives. I feel a little bit better because we're like near the entrance of this place yeah, we're, we're at so, the end of our night right now we're at the end of our night so it was a lot worse than what we're feeling now and uh take a look at why yeah. sounds like that same yeah. shitty ass exhaust right yep <laughs> ben come here yeah Dude, cut the light cut the light yeah. My hands are so cold, bro. I literally don't know what to do. My hands are so cold. Holy fuck! Holy Oh shit! Bro! Fuck! Oh! Holy shit! Holy fuck, bro! Fuck! Fuck! Good? Yeah! Watch this up! Oh! Holy fuck! Oh! That bird bend, you good? Yeah, yeah, yeah! Go, go, go! Go, go, go! Oh, fuck. oh shit! Oh, fucking mud, bro. Be careful, be careful. Oh, fuck! Oh. Fuck, bro. Oh, holy fuck. Oh, holy fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, oh, fuck. Oh, oh, fuck. Oh, shit. Oh, 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 Oh. 
Holy. Oh. Oh. Holy shit. Hey. Yo. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, oh. Bro. Um, they're, they're, they're not, they're not moving. Uh, bro, bro, bro. Uh, we can't both fit on this road. We really can't. Well. Oh, oh shit. Yeah, why are they oh. driving in front of us? Ben, put the camera on. Let's go. Yeah, yeah. Oh, oh, fuck. Okay. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Holy oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Ben, they're stopping. Ben, they're stopping. Ben, they're stopping. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Ben, they're stopping. Oh, they're stopping. Oh, fuck. Fuck. What a. Ah. Oh, my God. Oh, fuck, Ben. Oh, shit. Fuck. They're turning around. They're turning. Excuse my French. I felt that. Yeah, I did too. Oh, oh no, bro. Oh, okay. oh, it's like a roller coaster. We were just on this road. Oh, fuck. Where are we going? It doesn't make any sense, bro. We followed the direction. We had the direction, bro. We... Uh, I'm losing my fucking mind right now. I'm losing my mind. This doesn't make sense. This doesn't make sense. And every time we turn off the fucking camera too. Every time we turn, we turn the camera off because we thought we were out. We thought we were getting out. And then the, it was so uncomfortable. Like, it was like, we both were like facing each other. I flashed my lights for them to go. They flashed their lights for me to go. So I pulled over, they, then they drove by. They were just staring at us the entire time. Yeah, it was weird. I thought we were, I thought we were good. Then they, then they stop, bro. They, what, they stopped in the middle of the road. They stopped in the middle of the road, yes, I know. I know. And we gotta get the fuck out of here right now. Who's that? You're there, right? Yeah. All I hear is running water now, but... But this could be a trap. It's not like crying. That's a trail system right there. Yeah. If, if you want to go up there. That would just sound like crying. Yeah. Hold on. So what's our course of action right now? Um what do we think about going forward? Like, do you I think mean, we're heading the right direction or where, where I are don't we? know. We legit have no service at all. That's for starters. And another thing, I feel like I'm hearing footsteps. We definitely heard footsteps. Yeah. We were sitting here looking for like a new point, trying to get some service. We've been driving around literally in circles. It's so late, guys. It's so late. We just want to get out of here. After everything we experienced tonight, from the people with that weird sound alarm in the woods to everything, yeah. it was absolutely nuts. All right, like I just want to get out of here. Yeah, tired. That's footsteps. 
I hear branches breaking. Just lay low. Yo. Put your seatbelt on. Actually, I feel much more safe in the car than outside. Yeah. Truth be told. Yeah. Um, what do we do? I mean, at the end of the day, we're much more safe in the car than outside, right? That's true. Right? Absolutely. You think we came from back that way, right? I have a feeling. Well, we're on the narrow ass roads. I mean, look, look straight ahead. Like, this is what we're dealing with. Half the road is like caved in. Yeah, I know. There's a tree branch up there, too. And the water's running all the way. I know, it's fucking terrifying. I just don't want to end up somewhere like I have no idea where I'm going. Which, regardless, is where we're at right now. Yeah, so. I mean. Um, ben, what the fuck is that? What is that? Oh, holy fuck! fuck. Whoa, 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 whoa! Holy shit, bro! What the? F what the? F what the? F holy fuck, bro! Holy, f bro! Holy shit! Yo, I can get my seat up. <laughs> I'm so laid down. Oh my god! Oh, oh! Oh, that rose. Blocked off? Yeah. Yo, oh, shit. Oh, my God. I, I oh can't my see God. jack shit. Oh, but, my but, God. Put the camera on. Put the Okay. Huh. That, was, that was literally... Yeah. Legs. Uh, no, that was a person. Yeah. And then they decided to pound on my car for Bro, whatever what, reason. Why? What the f***? I don't know. I don't know. What? Why is a great question. Absolutely amazing question. It's tight than fucking group. Every time we go out here, you know, they send yeah. someone out just to fuck with us. I, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what we're doing. I don't. I don't like it. I want to get out of here. I never yeah. want to come back ever again. For real. Literally, like, what the hell was that? What was the point of like? What was the point? Is my question at this point. Yeah, like what? 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 What's to gain? What's to gain? Come on. Unless like I'm so bro. Yo, what if someone's? Yo, what if? What, what if some like? Obviously, there's some crazy shit going on here, right? Yeah. Obviously. We just got pounded yeah, on. Yeah, I know, I know, I know. Yeah, what's up? Hey, they're, they're trying to scare us, right? Clearly, there's something much worse going on here. Because, like, they're trying to... Anyone who comes in here, through here, they're just trying to scare away. Like, what the f***? Why? Like, what, we're asking, why would someone do that? That'd be against someone away. Away from I don't know. I just saw something lit up over there in the woods. Sort of God. I hate this place. I'm gonna be honest, bro. Yeah. I absolutely can't stand this place. Top ten worst places. That's crazy. It was crazy. After everything we went through tonight, after everything we went through tonight, I really thought we were... It's been a while. I really thought we were cool. I, th I thought we got away. Yeah. But it looks like, looks like no matter what happens, you're never alone. There's always somebody or yep. something. Yep. You get away from one group, there's another. You go. You get away from this, there's that. Yep. Like, you, you just can't... You. This place is bad shit, bro. It's literally it's fucking horrible. wild. Yeah. Yes, it is. God forbid a deer hop so I'm going so fast on these rocky roads. This is absolutely 
like one of the most one of the worst nights of my life hands down i've been saying that a lot lately absolutely but here this place is no nothing good comes out of this place no no nothing in most places it's like it's like you take the good with the bad you know you find a cool place oh this is nice blah 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 you know whatever this is like fucking no phone all the time no fun zone no service no service zone no fun zone no nothing dead no goat zone apparently dead goat zone absolutely Oh, and oh, bad road zone. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Would it be real though, Ben? Yeah. It's gonna take a lot for me to ever even consider coming back here ever again. Yeah. Ever. Yeah. It's like a three strikes you're out type type deal, you know? Like, yeah. No, I'm. Too much weird shit happens. You check off the list. It's over. Fuck would they put in a car like that? Yo, that's that's the thing, bro. In the dark. They're running like sneaking around like that. Like bro. in pants. Just That was loud as shit, bro. It was, bro. I'm sorry I freaked out like that. I'm sorry, RIP headphone users, but I'm just saying, like, in that type of mood, like, you don't know what to do. You know no, what I mean? No. You, you literally don't know what to do. So like when it all happened, like I freaked the fuck out, obviously. Yeah. I, yeah. I, I what the fuck? Oh. What the hell was that, bro? Oh my god. Bro. All right, everybody, how's it going? Uh, ben and I are back here in this beautiful forest. <laughs> oh yeah, winter wonderland. Yes, and it's actually raining today. It's not even snowing, it's raining, so that's fun. The mix is gross. And, um, perfect day to wear the Crocs, you know. You know how we do. But, but um, we're back here because we got a lot of information, more information about this forest, and it's actually a lot more dark than we thought. A lot more dark. A lot, yeah. Uh, it was absolutely nuts. So earlier today, we came here. So as you guys know, uh, we live in the northern part of the country and it gets super dark super early now. Like it gets mm -hmm. dark at like 4.30. Yep. So we came here around like four and we're like, all right, we're gonna get some daytime footage. Completely forgot about the fact that it gets super dark so fast. And uh, we found a Amish guy on a carriage uh, coming down the, the road where we were. So I thought this was the perfect opportunity to finally talk to somebody. And I felt as if we approached him without a camera, without any equipment, maybe they would actually give us a time of day. Yep. Gentleman was amazing. Absolutely awesome guy to give us so much information really about friendly. like everything and the yeah. history of this place. Absolutely. So at least the history that they believe and that they go by. Um, it's absolutely nuts. I'm gonna come in that in just one second. But another thing, the reason we came back here was to show you guys these yeah so what this is right here is we found a camera in these uh woods uh the last time we were here la last week and um there was film inside of the camera we got those pictures developed barely any of the pictures actually developed there was yeah, there's a lot that were like a lot were just or black, black yeah. pictures and you know so we will we'll show you all that in a little bit i want to talk to you guys about the story of what happened here hundreds of years ago and what's still going on you guys ready it's going to take about five to ten minutes to cover everything so if you want to skip the little story time by all means do so but here we go with this story it's a wild one yeah so back in the day a long long time i'm talking hundreds of years ago from what he told us in the late 1700s mm -hmm. there were in this area two communities very 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 split communities one side was the Puritans, or in this, the way he explained it, the normal people. And there was the other side in which the Puritans called the witches. Now, the reason they were called witches was because they practiced magic and they did a lot of stuff with herbal medicine. 
they pra- I, I don't know what they were doing some weird recipes and stuff like that yeah. from what he was saying now things got weird uh really fast the reasons why the communities were so split up was because the puritans believed the witches to be pure evil they they, they thought that yo i just Gosh, Man. Bro, it's the second I bring. It, it wasn't this Yo, bad. It's the it second wasn't. we start talking about this damn story. Here, <laughs> let's face this way. So, yeah, we lose some of the wind. All right. Um. So the reason why these two communities didn't get along was because the Puritans believed that the witches o- were only associated with bad stuff, with dark magic, with the devil. From what they said over and over again, mm-hmm. and they they believed that there would be no good coming from working with magic and working with just anything that wasn't what the puritans did they they just butted heads constantly now the massive turning point in the history in this forest was when the puritans sent over a child a little girl to go and spy on the witches and act as if she was one of their own now back in the day they all wore the same types of clothing they all like essentially they looked very similar because they didn't have no H and M's and no no champs full yeah. lockers back there. They all wore similar. There's shit. one way to make a shirt, and that's how you do it. Yes, you know. So, she was over there, and essentially, she stole a, a athemy from what I believe it was yeah. called. Yeah. Yes. So she was she was like a spy, and she was trying to like gather whatever information she could for the Puritans, but she found a holy item. Which the which is called the athemy. Now, once again, I'm all, or I'm only s- or something. Like, athem, something athem, like, something like yeah. that. Yeah. I'm just telling you guys. I'm replaying what the Amish gentleman told us earlier. Now, once she got the athem, on the way back she was caught. Now they didn't take this lightly at all. They took this very seriously and they killed the child. They killed the little girl and. Oh gosh, uh, the gentleman told us that they set up an effigy. Now. Me and Ben had no idea what an effigy was, so we Googled it. Dear God. It's very normal to not know what an effigy was, because, yeah. yeah, I never really wanted to know that. No, it know? was very, very graphic. Very, very graphic, yep. and I highly suggest don't look it up. But this was the turning point in history for these two communities. Um, from what the gentleman told us earlier was that this was where the most bloodiest and darkest times began. and. He described it as a story of vengeance. He said yeah, yeah, on yeah. all sides. He yeah, said he, there was no winners. He, he said there was no winners because of what happened current was happening current day, and we'll cover that in a second. Mm-hmm. But um, essentially, this took years, guys. I'm telling you guys, this took years. But in the end, uh, the Puritans won. Levi was the name of one of the higher ups in the Puritan community. He decided that you know they're gonna take initiative and they're gonna wipe out the entire which population and that they did uh because they just outnumbered them by by the, the thousands yeah, at that yeah, 10 gross. cents you know yeah yeah and there were at one point it turned from a war to a witch hunt is what the uh amish gentleman told us earlier mm-hmm. and they said it was a witch hunt because they were literally on the run looking for these witches they wanted to wipe them out and leave none remaining mm-hmm. now there was one remaining at this point and she was named by her community Tzedekah. Tzedekah was known as a very like nice charitable charitable person in the witch community right i i use witch because like i don't like that term i don't i don't like the term witch because i don't you could believe in what you want guys i just don't believe that there's people in broomsticks flying around and you know fire thunder (laughs) Sure, I do believe in like herbal medicine and stuff like that. Sure, you know, but yeah, I, I don't know if which is the correct term. Yeah. Regardless, let me continue. Um, Tzedeka was the name in that community. The name that they called her in the Puritan community and to this day is Nama. N A A M A H. I actually asked him how to spell it because mm-hmm. I was like Nama. How, how do you spell that? But essentially, they called her Nama because they believed her to be a demon. Supposedly, Nama is a demon name. I've mm-hmm. never heard of it in my life. You mean never? So, uh, when they told us all this information, like I was like, "This is nuts!" Right? Yeah. Nuts. And they said that they tell this story. This is like a folklore here. Like this is like the town story, mm-hmm. you know. And it's really scary once you once you really think about it. And the reason they call her Nama is because when the last I did not like that. I did not. Like that I, I did not like that. Hold on. Really quick. Oh, 
Bro, I did not like that at all. What? Like my whole that, that sound I just heard, like yeah, just sent chills down my entire body. Holy shit, bro! What the hell is this, by the way? Whole bunch of crackers. crackers. Why? Okay, but if you look this way, there's like a trail, right? Yeah. Almost like it goes over there. All right, hold on. Uh, like I was saying, Nama. The reason they called her that was because when she the last witch was killed not ma herself um she had a book with her uh, technically like a diary like she wrote shit in it but inside of this diary there wasn't just like journal entries if you will right, there was right. recipes there was um what the gentleman told us earlier sigils like demonic sigils like the one that we've seen recently the one that's like a the infinity sign with yep. the up and like that yep they said that is um one that they saw in that book a ton a whole bunch of them mm -hmm. and apparently she called herself nama in the book now this is where things get absolutely nuts and a lot of things start making sense who the last page of the book keep in mind this is all word of mouth and the reason why it's word of mouth is because everything was burned all property of nama and all the witches was burned I'm yeah they believe houses it books mm -hmm. it was sacrilegious they had to go yes you know? they had they, they were like you know what let's wipe our hands clean and never existed let's move on puritans mm -hmm. rule the world kind of thing like that's that's what they believed in right so on the last page nama wrote and it was like a spell or something if you will she said if i die by the hands of a puritan made the entire village be cursed for all eternity and on every holy day it will be a bloodbath yeah. and then a bunch of other stuff in the language that no one understood right mm -hmm. now you believe what you want right this is just how the story goes i'm just informing you on the story i'm not saying i believe any of this it just once again there's all word of mouth from hundreds of years ago yeah, exactly like we're, i say when you're everything burned too like this story passed on for so long it's it's, it's just like, like telephone it's like the telephone game yep. i could tell you potato and by the end you're saying yellowstone national park you know exactly. it, it, it goes like that yeah so when, when you think about it now here's the thing where he said it's crazy because this tradition still stands this, this is why it's crazy on the first sunday after nama was killed a bunch of people from the puritan village from the rest of the village if you all just call it the village from now on mm -hmm. died it was a bloodbath nine people died in an hour from illnesses from coyotes attacks from coyotes and just a bunch of things and levi said you know what guys we have to completely go into lockdown and mm -hmm. we need to protect ourselves by the name of god so go to your livestock which is like your animals your pigs goats sheep cows and use the blood of the livestock and protect your homes in the sign of a cross so now at this point they were going and killing their pigs or killing their mm -hmm. cows and using the blood and painting like a like a bloody cross on the doors on every Sunday. This started just from that Sunday. But yep. after that hour of nine people dying, they didn't want to take any risks. And then this is when they really started believing in all of this witch stuff, right? Mm -hmm. Now, to this day, they still do not come out on Sundays. Now, it's crazy to think about this, but the last time Ben and I were here was on a Sunday and we didn't come across anybody. Yep. And we're back again. Today is a Sunday. I'm not joking you. Look right here. Sunday, November 21st. Sunday, Sunday, Sunday. Sunday. So that's the tradition now. They believe that once the sun sets on a Sunday, it's time for everyone to go inside and mark their doors with a bloody cross. Now, here's where things get very, very coincidental to where it involves Ben and I, right? From what the gentleman told us earlier is that they've been using baby goats because upon more research throughout the hundreds of years, it's been like 200, yeah, yeah about, two, about 220 yeah. years. They believe that like that somehow is better. They believe that the goat is used in holy aspects and in unholy aspects, but they believe that the goat is the, is the, <laughs> the goat <laughs> way to handle things, I guess. Oh, no. Sorry, it's too, it's too soon, it's too soon. But, um, they believe that that's the way to handle things. Now, 
This kind of makes sense because Ben and I encountered a baby goat the other day on the side of the road yeah. in a garbage bag. And when we really thought, we didn't mention this to the gentleman at all because once again, the person who threw the goat outside of the window was in a truck. Amish people don't drive vehicles from what we understand. They drive yeah. a horse and buggy. Yeah. So a lot of things are weird in this storyline. A lot of things, there's a lot of uh, holes in this. Yeah. But it makes a lot of sense because now we understand that on Sundays, they, they truly, truly believe that on Sundays, if they're not inside, when it's nighttime, they will die. They will get killed. Yeah, yeah. So here we are playing Randonautica. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god <laughs> on so after all that we're out here <laughs> on a sunday on a sunday at 9 33 i mean it's still early so and it's it's changed over to snow now it's, it's, we're in snow now yeah it's like a rain fr gross it's weird it's like i don't know it's cold it's, it's very cold yeah but, uh i don't know how long we'll be staying tonight probably until midnight i think that's fair because it makes sense you yeah, know we're gonna spend this sunday here and we're gonna see what's gonna happen mm -hmm. now obviously if you guys have seen the last two videos um of the series here you've known that we've went through some crazy ass shit. we found some crazy stuff yeah. we found clothes we found shoes hanging on trees which i did read in a lot of comments people were saying that shoes hanging on trees is either involved with deaths so people have died in that area and they hang up one of their oh, like no. some really? of their uh possessions oh. to show like they died here I don't know. Wow. But a little memorial. You guys have been shedding a lot of light in the comments. I want to say I really do appreciate it. If you have any theories as to what the hell is going on here, because Ben and I are still trying to put the pieces of the puzzle together. Yeah. If you have any, let us know down in the comment section below. Um, ben, what do you think of everything? What do you think of the story that gentleman told us? Be, was your honest? So like everything got burned. Yes. Which kind of like discredits. Yeah. It's I like, could be like Ben, I won the lottery, but yeah. I burned the lottery ticket, you so know I that, missed out. You know. You know that expression. Uh, History is written by the victors. I mean, who won? Yeah. They're, they're telling us a story that's been passed on From generation to generation to generation. And, you know, sometimes you gotta add a little honey to the story. You catch sure. more flies with honey than you do uh, with vinegar, so. Hey. There we go. That's really true. That's true. And that's true. I, I guess they, what they do say is traditions like are carried on for generations and generations. And that's what that's what's happening here. Yeah. I mean, because literally they're still scared of this Nama. Yeah. So yeah. I asked, you know, what Nama is. They said it's just a demon. That That's all that the gentleman said. It's just yeah. a demon. And, that's get, that. and a lot of people have gotten, when we ask, a lot of people have gotten really short with us. So yes. it's really quiet usually. It's really, really quiet. So really cool. Uh, we actually entered in one of like the little Amish villages earlier. Um, we didn't bring any phones or any... Winter has come. Damn, bro. Oh, oh my this. god, bro. Look at this. But you know what's the crazy part, bro? We more to do this little, like, it was like raining. Information portion right here. It wasn't raining and it wasn't windy at all. Yeah. This is literally just coming out of nowhere. It's kind of nowhere. It's not ma, bro. I'm telling it's you. It's not ma. <laughs> oh, no. But, um, yeah, we're going to fire up Radio Nautica. We got some intents that we're going to use. Uh, what we're trying to do is we're trying to see if we could come across anything that could give us proof of this story mm -hmm. or just in general. Because last time we were here, once again, we keep having issues with this white truck, right? Now, we clearly know that this white truck has nothing to do with the Amish. At least that's what we think, right? Yeah. So now we're battling two battles over here. We're battling things that the Amish told us in terms of like, the supernatural, if Yeah, you will. like warnings from yes. the Amish. So... We're facing that and then we're facing a crazy person in a truck who chased us in the woods. So yeah. yeah, there's that. But we did come on a day where we told nobody when we were going. We kind of just showed up. And I want to give a big thank you to the person who um, messaged me that works at CVS, the manager at CVS, and they actually got us hooked up with these pictures very, very fast. So thank you. And I'm going to be showing you what's That's on love. these pictures. And um, with all that being said, I don't know, that story was a mouthful, but it's crazy. It's it, fucking it's wild. It's crazy to think about like, the type of shit that went on back in the day here. Yeah. Now, even if that was like a little swayed the story, mm -hmm. we know that it is somewhat true. Yeah, yeah. There's some. There's truth there. If we gotta try to figure out what, if it we could can. Be, it could be a lot, you know, lighter or a lot more dark. Yeah. We truly don't know. We have no idea. So let's go ahead. Let's fire up some Aeronautica and let's see where this takes us today. Let's see what type of shit we come across tonight. I'm excited, guys. So. uh if Let's you're excited it. too, make sure to smash that like button. What are you doing if you didn't? Come on. Press it. It takes a second. Gosh, Come damn. on, guys. All right. I'll see you in a sec. Peace. <laughs>
Hey Ben. Hey. I'm gonna need to start carrying your own weight. You're not you're not packing enough shit. Well so I'm trying to carry my own weight. But I have your <laughs> I have your weights, I have my weights in here. Yeah. Got, yeah. Jeez. This guy I I do respect it though, because Ben is the most prepared person ever. I love when you guys are like jazz, you never wear gloves in the in the forest oh. or look at Ben. Okay, I got him. It is cold tonight. Well, oh, needless to God. say, we are lost in the woods, but... Yeah. yeah. I was going to wait for the gloves, but I was like, you know what? I feel like we're going to be out here for... And you guys... I got to say something real quick. Oh, let me turn this bad boy around. You guys always yell at me for wearing bright colors, and then I actually listened, and I bought like an olive green jacket so I could like hide in the woods, and then Ben comes along <laughs> wearing every nice. color on the primary color scale when they chase me they be like damn he's colorful <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's, he's dressed nice but yeah not exactly sure what we're doing here but uh i completely forgot what our intent was but i'll put it on screen right now thank you so much for submitting your intent sorry it's been like 30 minutes of walking in the woods uh it helped when we had service, I'll say that at least. Um, there's pros and cons to not having service. I'll get to that in a sec. But, um, yeah. Gosh, how heavy is that? I didn't wait it yet. <laughs> Jeez. Mommy. Mommy, here you are. Thank you, sir. All right, well, there's pros and cons to not having service, I'll be honest. We don't get spam calls. Yeah, exactly, bro. That's, that's yeah, but I'll show you right now. Once again, just for the aesthetic, I guess. No, no spam mail. Um, no spam calls, no spam mail. I mean, we used to get those weird ass calls all the time. I specifically did, but you've yeah. seen some of them when you were with me. Yeah. It's nuts. Um, now we're just following, I don't even know, if the, would you consider this a trail? <laughs> it's, it's something. It was really windy. And yeah, it was. I think we're so deep in where the wind's just not hitting. Yeah. I don't know. I don't know. Shut up. Bro. That was chains. You heard that, right? Yeah, you heard like a chain? Those are definitely chains that I, we heard. Yeah, I heard that too. Okay. You could, um... Oh, and it's the wind. I mean, it could be the wind as well. Damn, that's loud. That's loud. I would um definitely turn the lights on if you don't mind. Yeah. Just so we have as much light as possible. Um, That's nuts. That sounded like a chain, but it could just be like audio coming... Audio. But like sound coming through the... um. The wind, you know? Yeah, Cause yeah. Wind carries that shit. I'm just, I did, I have like, I put the still paranoia in myself. I'm just saying like, what if like, I just glance my flashlight over and I, I like, I see like people standing there like. I know, I think that all the time. I'll pull my pants, <laughs> right here. Ah, yo, actually, you know what, Ben? What's up? You asked me earlier, should we, cause um, you were like, oh, why do we keep coming here? <laughs> Yo, <laughs> Ben was like, <laughs> Ben was like, everyone in my family, everyone I know has asked me, you were like, oh, your parents. Yep, yep. yep. Just only everyone has said like, why, why are you going back again? And it's just like, you know? The comments. <laughs> the comments. So I'm going to put something out there. How about this? If this video gets 17,000 likes, Ben. Oh no. I need you on board with this. Okay. We come back here with a tent and we camp out for the night. Oh. We do an overnight here. Overnight in oh, the bro, haunted no. something. Yo, by the way, oh. let's let's do that. We're gonna shake on it. Bro, uh, uh we doing it? <laughs> oh, I'm gonna regret this, bro. You were talking about some type of light goal to do because it would be fun. I think yeah, that's a good yeah, light you know goal. What? Yeah, you're right. Seventeen thousand likes and we come back here and spend the night. Alright. Hopefully on a much less windy day. Yeah, but, for, oh, um, it's not as cold. Oh my god. I was gonna say, so we're gonna come back here in the winter. 
So we're gonna, after tonight, we're gonna chill out with this place because I really do think that we're pushing our luck and yeah. stuff. So we need a name for this place. Like there is an actual name for it, but we wanna have our own name so we can name like the series that we're doing. So what should we call this place? We, uh, uh, the, 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 the haunt, you can't yeah. say haunted forest. There's so many haunted forests. White Shark Mountain. <laughs> <laughs> I was gonna say like the blank forest, you know? Oh no. Like, like there's like the Fuck uh, that white truck. <laughs> the white truck. Yeah, <laughs> actually. Yeah. Let me know down in the comments if you guys got a name for this. If we do pick your name, we'll we'll uh give you some credit. We'll credit, yeah. Alright, we can go downhill. Or we can still follow this kind of trail. It's going up though. That's right. It was deep down there. Oh my god. Yeah, bro, we're in the middle of it. Miles and miles of trees and woods. I mean, it's, it makes a lot of sense when you uh, remember the conversation we had with the Amish gentleman. Yeah. And when he was saying, like, they, they, like, to this day, they still find, like, remains and stuff in these forests, bro. Yeah. It's, it's scary. Because you gotta think about how much of this is, like, on unvisited like look how vast this is bro i know all you hear is me you and the wind and that guy over there we hear him too yeah <laughs> yo what's up i'm just kidding <laughs> <laughs> don't be anyone else it's like that one scene from spongebob with the telemarketers or another door door salesman they're like, the, 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 the like he's on to us <laughs> yeah. Good, man. We need a damn heater in this place. Yo. What's that shiny thing? Yeah, I immediately saw it running on the corner. Yeah, like it reflected on the... It reflected with the flash there. Okay. It's like a... Like a little crock pot. Oh, bro. what's cooking, bro? Bro, what's cooking? Good looking. What's, what's <laughs> in here? Ugh. Doesn't smell like anything. I can attest that I smell literally everything on the planet. Yeah, no food here. Um, should I? Hold on. We should be very weary. Something like this in the middle of the woods, bro. Yeah, bro. On, on a path. Yes. Hmm. Well, this is like a trap. Not a trap, but like a like a setup. Not a setup, but like a. Bro, is that a cabin? Come here. Stop. In the distance over there. It's really hard to see. Almost oh, like it does look like it. Right? Yo, it might be. Holy shit. Alright, maybe we should. Why? Alright, here we go. Alright. Dinner served. We got Jesus. Quite literally. Oh, oh okay. Yeah, I thought yeah, you were saying Jesus. Quite <laughs> literally. Um, oh, literally Jesus. Literally Jesus. Yeah. With Spartans, right? Is that Spartan? Yeah, it looks like a Spartan. Spartacus. From three hundred. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> King of the gems. That says up top. That's weird. There's some more stuff in here. There's another Jesus. A smaller Jesus. Yeah. Okay. Your future is as bright as your faith. Oh shit, bro, look at these diamonds. Oh. Do wow. I have like no balance? I'm sorry. Bro, I'm a hell of her. Yeah. Okay. I'm, I'm over here We're like a hell right now. <laughs> I'm not drunk, I swear. <laughs> yeah, there's that. It's kind of nice. It's like glisten. Yeah. Oh gosh. Yeah. Well, that's well, nice. kind of nice and kind of not. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay. When sie diesen Brief finden, bleiben sie bitte weg. Beat the dragon, see die. Gegenstate, bro. I'm, I don't know. 
Wait a second. Dick and got. Yo, this. A lot of this sounds a little familiar from the shit that was in the. That was written on the camera bag in the last video. Yeah. Video. What was that? What I was the like with it? A lot of people in the comments were saying, like, it. Oh my shit. Oh my shit. A lot of people in the comments, I remember they translated it. I don't know the exact translation, but they said something like, um, the translation said, like, you need to get out of here or something like that. Sounds German. Yeah. In the way you're reading it, at least. Should I translate it quick? Oh, shit, can you? Everyone yells at me for not translating things. I'm like, all right, finally, I'll. I just remembered why I don't translate things. I don't service. Ah, uh, you need service to translate. It, it's. It's it's been a rough night, guys. We we came. I think from. You gotta work with those cheeses. Come on. Just lean. Just lean a little bit. Ah uh, no, this is not good. All right. Well, like I was saying, we started filming like at like nine, right? Yeah. Yeah. And it's twelve sixteen now. Like it's been a while, guys. We we've we've been out here lots of busts, but now we're finally deep in the. These forests, I mean, not yeah, like I'm something. saying finally as if like, yay, but we came across something. Now it's all about what that message means. That message could give us so much context right now, like. We came across a Jesus in the crock pot. I do think I see a cabin down there though, so I should. Yeah, I think I did see a cabin, bro. Straight down there. I see like a corner. Is it like abandoned or is it like this one in there? I don't know. That's the thing about the Amish. They don't have like lights outside their house. They don't have like Phillips Hughes, you know? Yeah. Wait, what is that? They're only on smart light bulbs. Bro? What? Is that a cross? Stop, bro. Bro, that's a grave. Yo, what? Ben. That's a grave. We're in front of a grave site. Oh, fuck, bro. Ben, we're in front of a grave site. I'm not shining my light down there, bro. I think that just solidified the fact that uh, someone's house is here. Yeah. Was it like it saw a tomb like stone or what was it? I don't. It wasn't a tombstone. I'm not, I'm sorry. I'm just looking because I'm trying to get out of here. It wasn't a tombstone, bro. That was like a that was like a like a wooden cross, multiples of them. You didn't see them? Oh. Yo, Shimali. They're over there to the left a little bit. You're not gonna be able to see them on camera. Oh shit. They're far down. You see that? You can like someone maybe like a I guess multiple pets or something. Pets? I don't know, Remember bro. the pictures? Holy yeah, fuck. Yeah, bro. yeah. I mean they those don't look anything like the ones in the picture, but Holy wait, fuck. Wait, 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 Ben, Ben, Ben. That's a door. You guys heard a shot? Yeah. That was a door. I knew it. That is a fucking cabin, bro. You want to get lights out? Yeah. You see there's like a lake over there, too. That uh, looks like a lamp. lantern or something. Yo, Ben. I'm going to keep this light to the floor. Come on. If it's 12 16 when i told you the time yeah that means it's not sunday anymore remember oh. the story yeah uh, is that what you forgot yes but the amish people they stay inside on sundays because they're scared of uh uh what's her name fuck oh, uh shit. nama 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 fuck. yeah because they're scared of nama they, they stay inside on sundays it's no longer sunday it's monday now Oh, I see. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Got you. So everyone in this area who's alive is alive. Wait, hold on. No, let's keep walking. Let's yeah. Yes, yeah, bro. What the? Turn those lights on. Yeah. Okay, so, I don't know, man. I don't see anything. Oh, but 
That was definitely a door and I definitely saw like a red light. It's just odd to me how those sticks are like that. What are you thinking? I'm just remembering the stories that were told and I'm starting to question. I don't know. I mean, some things do line up. Wait. Oh. Yeah, it's starting to line up. <clears throat> I always say how much coincidence is before it's not a coincidence yeah. anymore. Wait. Did we, did we come from here or from there? Ah, shit. Hold on. Um, had to have been left, right? Yeah, I think it goes left, I'm pretty sure. What was that? Hey, you read that too? Yeah. Alright, dude. Keep an eye. I'm ready to run out of here, Ben. Yeah. But the thing is, what direction? Yo, is that a tree broken like that before? Which one? That one right there. I don't know. Why? I do remember the blue thing. I do too. The I just don't remember it being broken, bro. I mean, the wind's kind of strong, right? Yeah. Strong enough to do that? That one right next is broken like that too, you see? Oh, yo, what the f***? It's just broken just like that. Wait a second. Trail to the left, trail to the right. I don't remember, bro. Oh. Ben, what is that right there? Oh shit. Yo, what the f is that? Ben? Is that another fucking goat? Ben, is that another goat? Oh my god. Oh. It's Sunday, bro. My it make fucking God. holy shit. Ben, just just don't look around. Keep walking. Okay guys, so we're still in the woods, but we're mm -hmm. gonna take a little bit to show you guys the photos that we got. I mean, from the first photo, you can already tell uh, we got this power couple right here, this power Amish couple. He looks like Daniel Tosh. Who? Daniel Tosh? You know that one, like he used to have that one comedy show. It was like he went over like YouTube videos back in the day. Skinny dude, really offensive. Oh, I do actually. He was on Comedy Central, right? Yeah, yeah. I think I know who you're talking about. I mean, kind of, bro. Doesn't it? Look at the action right there. You see what I'm seeing right there? Ooh. Now that, Ooh. that right there, is a sign. That's a sign. Yes. They may more. They may be more than just friends. There might be more to this couple than we think. There might be a, a, a third member of this couple. That's is me. <laughs> yeah, yes. I don't know. <laughs> Power couple, but. Oh! Oh my goodness! Confirmed. Confirmed. Oh, we already saw these photos. Yeah. yeah. But um, there's that baby right there. Now, here's the thing. I was very worried about these photos because I was worried. Uh, I took the film out of the camera like an idiot. But I don't know much about cameras, guys. I really don't. But I do know that if there's light exposure or air exposure or whatever kind of exposure, it could hurt the film and hurt the photos on the film. Especially old film, too. Especially old film. So, yeah. So there's That's why some of these photos, like... There's just that, so. Good old nothing. Yeah. Good old nothing. Oh, good old something. 
Yeah, that one. This one was the one I really wanted to talk about. What the fuck? They do satanic rituals in this forest, Ben, I'm telling you. Mm -hmm. There's something going on in this photo. There, you could see a lot of people um, have like the type of hoods on their heads, almost like the 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 some of the women that we saw in the pictures that had the it's almost like some type of covering on their head mm -hmm. but i'm telling you bro there are satanic rituals that happen in these forests and we can confirm it now absolutely because of everything that we've seen this was very interesting to me as well we don't know how old this photo is when it was taken but if this is from this area then that means that this property is still on this area, this village, mm -hmm. this this wooded area. Right, right. What if we stumble upon this? I poop my pants. I will too. It'd be at the same time. This almost looks like there's like a person standing there or something, but still, photos damaged. Mm -hmm. Photos damaged. This is just a picture of the woods I looked at. So, there's that, there's that, there's that. Look at this one. These look a little bit older than the other two that we saw mm -hmm. earlier. Maybe it's their parents, but this is what I was talking about, like the head coverings that the yeah. woman were wearing in that photo. Mm -hmm. Very, very similar to that. So it probably was some type of satanic thing going on. Yeah. I don't even know if it's satanic ritual. I just want to say some type of ritual going on. Something right? not great. Something not normal, I would yeah. say. That, uh, that dude's pondering something right there. Yeah, he's thinking real hard. It's like, look at that camera. <laughs> look at that fine piece of electronics. Perfect. Another picture of the woods. And then there's this, which, in my opinion, looks like a cross. Almost like a, what would you oh, say? Yeah, How would I, I say this? It's like a corp. Not a corpse. Oh my god, like a grave site. Like yeah. they didn't have tombstones back. They might still not use tombstones. I don't right. know. Tombstones are very expensive. What they could do, like, doesn't it look like a cross up here and then this way? I know the photo's damaged, but uh, yeah, kind of. Yeah, yeah, that or like a like a light. No, they don't use light though. They don't use lights. Huh. That's weird. Damage, damage, and here's the same photo again, but you can see it this time, right? Oh yeah, yeah. It's like it's like a second photo they took of it. So that's what we dealt with. Uh, we drove hours for that. Yeah. Yeah. I'm sick. Oh. Think about it now, though. We have all these photos. We found it in that old ass camera. Mm -hmm. The camera's worth a lot of money. Really? Yeah, a lot of money. That's wild. That's nuts, yeah. And um. The fact that these photos are on there from so long ago blows my mind. It's just sitting out there. It just goes to show that like we could come across more stuff like this. Mm -hmm. So I'm super excited to go back into the forest Absolutely. and see what else we could come across. Mm -hmm. It'll be exciting. So with all that being said, um, we're gonna fire up right Antarctica in a little bit, and then um, we're gonna travel out a little bit and see what we could find. So we'll see you guys in a little bit. Peace. I don't know what Ben did, but I think he found the same radio yeah. channel again. Was that it? 95.1? Was that I, it last I, time? I'm 90% sure it was, bro. Hmm. Yeah, okay, hold on. I think we lost it. No. There's something there. Okay, so here's the thing, like, we, last time we... I like change volume really quick. Okay, well, thing is, um, when you go through like the woods like this, or anywhere in general, if you're on a radio station, sometimes you hear shit from like different radio stations. The crazy thing is like, we'll shuffle through the rest of the radio stations, there's like nothing. Yep. So maybe like, I don't know, I don't know how radio stations work. Sorry, I use CarPlay or AuxCord or you know, downloaded yeah, music. Yeah, or Bluetooth voice. I know? can't tell. Yeah, the Bluetooth. What can you say? I can't tell you the last time I've ever listened to the radio. I got yeah. the idea from you last time. 
It was amazing that I got to that point where it was like radio. <laughs> well, your phone's broken, so. That's fair. Yeah, it's amazing once your phone's broken. Old text is like, man. That's weird. There's nothing here. Yeah, private there's property a, of uh, what? Never mind. There's a trail right there. But there's a uh, massive tree that fell in the in the road. Like there's a tree on the ground. Really? So no cars getting through that. Huh? This probably hasn't. There might be some shit here. In the wild, I don't know if I want to find out. Just yeah. yeah. Maybe during the day. Yeah, yeah. Get an idea of where we're headed. Nothing. Someone's property or. We're just cruising right now. I'll listen to some radio. So I mean, like, I don't know. Was it ninety-five point one last time? I, I really don't. I think it was in the nines for sure. It was in the nines for sure. Yeah. like Tom and Jerry music. Yeah, I know. You know, like, when Tom is about to, like, get Jerry, but then <laughs> Jerry always comes out on top, you know? And then Tom just goes, yeah, whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Wait. What the fuck was that? Yeah, I saw that too. Hold on. Here you are, right? Yeah. I'm just trying to listen, man. I'm just listening to static at this point. Sorry, guys. Huh. I don't know. Do you hear anything? No, I'm not hearing anything. Whoa. Poor timing. Yeah. Really poor timing. Thanks, radio. Uh, hold on. You think this might be like a private broadcast or something? Like someone in the forest is privately broadcasting? What the hell is there a bike? There's against that though too. Is there? You can't just, yeah, like, like, the FCC will come knock on your door. Like, you can't just have your own, like, and there's regulations and there's... You're telling me I can't have, like, my own, like, I can't have, like, my Yasko It's, it's expensive. Like, FM. bro, like, these radio stations to run, they need, like, all this advertising money. But, like, why, this, there's no, I've not heard a single one. True. Every time we pick this up. Like, so not only... So they're not having ads, they have no way of making the money to do this. Why are they doing this? They're paying for the rights to play music or they're in trouble with the FCC. It's one or the other. I'm probably gonna get copyright striked right here, so... Yeah, we'll get in trouble, but they won't. They can have a radio station yeah, in the middle of the so woods. Fucking... Just heads up, if, I, if this is muted, I might put the text on screen. If this is muted, it's because of the music why. playing right now. Yeah. I'm gonna go check out this, uh, stay right here for a sec. All right, man. Just so you're a little safe. All right, I'm gonna go figure yeah. out. What the fuck was that? Hello? Did somebody just jump? You open the door? No, I, I don't know. I hope not. And I parked literally in front of mud. Sorry. I'm a good driver, I swear. That's how the pros do it. Well, well known fact. I'm just not trying to... No, I get you. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Holler if you need anything, brother. Yeah, I got you, bro.
Oh, good music stuff. Great, 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 great. Yo, I hope nothing wild happens while Jazz is gone. Holy shit. Yo, what is that? Oh shit. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Yo! Whoa, 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 what? What was that? What? Whoa, 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 whoa. Bro! Uh, what the fuck was that? What? No, 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 no. That was like a little girl shriek on God, on God, on God right now. What? Bro, like I'm actually. I, I had to like listen for a second, and I heard it coming from that side over there. And I, I listened, I listened, I listened, and I was like... Hold on, hold on. Why the hell is there a bike here? I'm literally like, I got chills down my entire body right now. Yeah, bro. It's not good. Not fucking good, man. My heart right now is like beating a hundred... Miles per hour. Should we just turn this off or what? Yeah, I don't need this extra. <laughs> this is extra. I'm yeah, sorry. I'm, yeah, we don't need 100%. this. 100%. We don't need this right now, bro. What the fuck do we I, when I saw that look on your face, bro, I was like, oh. Oh, yeah. yeah I that's that's the look. You hear that? Yeah, I heard that. That was the trees, right? I think it was. Some but, moving in the trees. Yeah. Hello? You said it sounded like a voice, right? Yeah, 100%. Yeah, that could have been a tree squeaking, I guess, but... No, no, bro, it's not even windy right now. Yo, you're right. Hello? Yo, anyone there? That was like an alarm, right? Yeah. Or whistle. Yo, hold on. I heard it again. We're getting ready to drive out of here. Hello? Should I honk? Maybe. No, nothing. It's not Roger Rabbit, so. <laughs> oh my god. You gotta take the flashlight? Yeah. Um, also, what is good with this damn tricycle, bro? Should we, should we like pick? What do we do with it? Find a tricycle or what do you do? I don't know. Like I'm completely puzzled. I've never. All right. Well, let's get out of here. Oh, that's skunk. Yeah, that's awful. Oh my. Oh. Wow. Oh. I smelled it when I was outside, but th there's no way a skunk. Skunks don't make sounds. No, no. Like cats, I think. All right, guys. 
I, I don't know what's going on here. I don't like it at all. I don't know why there's a kid's bicycle. No, like nothing, nothing's good. Amish people don't use bicycles, from what I understand. Right? They use carriages and horses and... Yeah, yeah. I mean, I don't, I don't know. That's a really good question, guys. I have no, I have no idea. I've never seen an Amish person ride I've never a bike. Seen, I know I've never seen an Amish person on a bike. That's a fact. Do you think they were like, what, like the old timey bikes? Like the ones with the big wheel in the front and the small ones in the back or? Like a tricycle? Kind of, yeah, but like the old, old timey ones. No, no, it wasn't like that. Oh. It was a regular bicycle. They use like treks, trek bikes. I don't know, bro, but I'm ready to get out of here. Yeah, I'm okay. I'm sorry. I'm, sorry. I, I'm tired. All right, see ya. <laughs> I am completely split from Jazz right now. Um, he, uh, bro, someone ran at us with a taser, dude. Holy shit. Jazz was pissing. I was just getting ready. We haven't even started yet. Luckily, I have my bag. Holy f I have the camera. Uh, I didn't see where Jazz went. This way towards the road. Yo, 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 yo. Oh, oh, oh. Is that the truck? Bro, bro. Holy, f holy fuck. I we I did not see the truck when we pulled in. Holy shit, bro. Holy shit. Holy fuck. Holy fuck, bro. Oh, they're coming towards me. Holy, holy shit. Holy shit, I'm laying down. I'm laying down, guys. Holy fuck. Holy fuck. Holy shit. Holy shit. Holy shit. Holy shit. Okay. It's like two people, someone's driving, and then there's someone with a flashlight pointing out the window. Where's someone with a tape? Yo. I wonder if it's the fucking dude. I wonder if it's the same dude. The one with the taser. Might be the same dude in the truck. Holy bro. I really was hoping we wouldn't run into him again. But here we are. Holy fuck. I'm keeping my light a little bit lower right now. Just with everything going on. Oh. Well, laying on the ground is cold. And when you have to do it, you know, like the adrenaline kind of just kicks in. But, uh, now that he's gone, I'm fucking freezing. Holy shit. Oh my god. Sorry, folks, I'm just fixing my hat. <sighs> Damn it, bro. Oh, fuck. Holy oh, shit, bro. Holy oh, fuck. No, no, no. Come on. Yo, someone's been pointing a flashlight. Oh, 
come back. Fucking truck. Okay. Oh, Yo. Come on. No one has a flashlight out though. Or maybe someone got in? I don't know. Fuck. Um. I have no idea where Jazz is. I have no service. I already checked. Let me check a little more. Yeah, nothing. Fuck, bro. Oh my. Excuse my French. Oh. I'm going deeper in. I can not get away from this guy. Holy fuck. Oh, lights are stopping. What's going on? Bro, I hate these f***ing woods, man. I hate these f***ing woods. It stopped. The car just stopped in the middle of the road. Okay. 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 Continue. Alright. I'm gonna go in the dark for now. I'm sorry, guys. I don't know who's out here with me right now. I'll turn the lights in a sec. Oh, I can't fucking see. Oh. Oh, fuck. Fuck, bro. What the hell? What the hell? Okay, I'm turning on the lights. I have to go see. What the fuck is that? Okay, hold on. I don't know if you guys can see that. What the fuck was I just looking at? Yo. 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 Oh, shit. There's someone coming with a flashlight. Oh, no. Not right now. Oh, fuck. Holy shit, bro. Are you fucking kidding? Are you fucking kidding? Yo, the flashlight's out. Yo, 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 yo. They were just walking this way. Oh, shit. Oh, shit, they're coming. Okay. Yo. Holy fuck. Holy shit. Holy shit. Holy shit. I almost tripped on something. Oh, my God. Okay. Okay. Um, I really don't know what to do. Um, what is that? What the f is? Oh shit! Oh, holy f Okay, yeah. There's something wild next to me right now. 
I'll show you guys in a sec. I have to turn off the light. I hear someone coming. Oh, f holy shit, bro. Holy. F holy. Oh, the light over there. I don't know if you can see that. Oh. Okay. Okay, really quick, guys. There's someone over there. I gotta shut the light in a sec. Um. I still haven't gotten anything from Jazz. Taser, bro. The taser. Holy shit, bro. Bro. Holy. Holy. Oh. Okay. Fuck. Okay. Good time to tell you guys. I got a knife on me. Um. I don't really go against someone with a taser. Uh. Well, I'll definitely threaten someone with a taser. Holy. Bro. You can see. Holy shit. Holy shit. Holy shit. What the f are you doing? Oh, okay. Okay. Oh. Okay. Get my knife out. Get my knife out. Cold on the ground. Holy shit. Okay. Holy shit, he can see me. He just disappeared. Like straight up. Oh fuck, and now the car lights are off. Holy fuck. Holy fuck. Oh. Oh. Oh shit. Guys, I have the camera down. I have the camera down. I have a knife. Okay. I have aimed at him. The camera's aimed at him right now. Holy shit. Holy shit. Holy shit. Holy shit. Oh fuck. Someone, man, I don't want to fucking do this right now. Holy shit. Yo, he's like chasing after some. Yo, oh, he's not chasing after Jazz, bro. What the fuck? Where is he going? What the fuck? Oh, Jazz. Oh, shit. Bro. Holy f Okay. And there's some crazy shit right in front of us. You can't really see it because the lights are off. Holy fuck. Okay. Hold on. Okay. Holy shit. What the fuck? Why? What the f is this thing? Bro. Holy f Okay. There's a lot to f unpack here. Uh. It's like a bunny that's been crucified. Or something. Maybe not cru- that might be the right word. Uh. Something f 
fucking horrible. <sighs> Hold on, I gotta pull it my knife. Holy shit, bro. Okay, okay. Alright, um, yeah, there's something fucking wrong with this picture, bro. Holy shit. And then there's this, which I don't even fucking know, man. What the fuck is this? It's chess, bro. There's writing on it, and I think it's supposed to be upside down because the writing, yeah, that, that shit's supposed to be upside down. I don't know why, uh, but clearly this is yours, my friend. I'm going to just go ahead and slide that right, right back in there. And uh, you have a good day now. And yeah, guys, I'm getting the fuck out of here. I'm gonna go back to the road. That guy's gone, so we should be good now, okay? Okay, cool, cool, let's go. Let's get the fuck out of here. What the fuck? Holy shit, bro. Holy shit. Okay. Okay, that car light is still on over there. But I think the guy that was in it, or the guys that are in it, went that way. They went that way, okay? So, I think we're cool. I think we're cool now. I just gotta find Jazz, but we're getting the fuck out of here. Holy fuck, bro. The lights just turned off. Now they're on again. What the Okay, we may have to show you this process up a little bit. Okay, okay. Yeah, the lights are on. Okay. Let's go. We're going this way. We're fucking going this way, okay? Holy shit. We're searching, we're going this way. Holy fuck. Holy fuck. Holy fuck, bro. Okay. Yeah, they're still on. And there's a flashlight. That's okay. We're just gonna keep on running. Right? Okay. Yo, this fuck is fucking heavy. Holy shit. Holy shit. Holy fuck, bro. Holy fuck. Okay. 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 Yo. I'm gonna duck off to the side for a little bit. In a sec. I can take a breather. Holy shit. I can't. Okay, I don't know if you guys can see that. That's a huge drop. And oh, the other lights are still coming, bro. Oh, we fuck, bro. Oh, shit. Oh, oh okay. My guys are running again. God damn it. Oh. Well, they still running down the hill. Okay. Oh, fuck. Oh, there's gotta be a place I can hide. Yo, that guy's got a car, man. Oh shit. Oh, okay. Oh, oh shit. Okay. Oh. Bro, I'm in this, like, I'm hiding like halfway down this hill. Okay. Holy fuck. Holy fuck. He's coming. He's coming. He's coming right now. Okay. Okay. We're going back in the ground. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. Holy fuck. Holy fuck. Okay. What's up, fam? Um, lots happened in the past little bit. Uh, to make a long story short, uh, I have no idea where Ben is. Can't get any reception at the moment. I'm currently, like, on a road. That, by the way, scared the shit out of me. I thought it was a flashlight, but it's just a reflector. <laughs> I literally sat here and I was like waiting. I was like, holy shit, they're after me. They're after me. Because what happened was, really weird story, actually. I'm going to try to keep this because I know you guys are, um, I know people are watching this with their families and stuff. So I'm going to keep this, j just a disclaimer right now. Um, close your ears, I guess. Uh, I was peeing. And Ben was like a little bit further down. Obviously, he was giving me my privacy while I pee. And all of a sudden, all you hear is like static electricity. Sound like a stun gun, taser, whatever you want to call it. 
Ben screams and Ben runs. I think Ben assumed that I was going to run with him. My willy was out. I didn't know what to do, so I started running with my willy out. And I ran, I ran, I ran. I had no idea where I'm going. And now I'm on, the, I'm on a road. I'm literally just on a road at the moment. And um, I'm not really sure. I've been walking. I came from down there. I came from all the way down there. Um, I took my camera out because, like I said, I shit my pants. I thought that was the light, but it's just a reflector, like the idiot I am. So, um, yeah, there's that. Um, I haven't heard anything from Ben in a while. I haven't heard any anything. So here we go. Um, the moon is shining bright tonight, folks. Let me show you. I don't know if you can see it up there. Oh, yeah, you can definitely see it. But let me show you guys. If I use this light right here. It lights up a lot more. I'm going to be using both just because I could see more. But this baby stretches on for miles upon miles. Road goes that way. Into the woods over here. Down there. There's so many reflectors, bro. It scares the shit out of me every time. And um, another thing I do want to say. I'm going to switch back to selfie mode. Give me a sec. I'm trying my best right now to keep my composure. And I want to apologize in advance because I know how loud this camera can get. It's a very, very loud camera. And makes a lot of noise when I touch the light up top. It makes a lot of noise when I do a lot of anything. So apologies in advance. Um, I'm just recording right now. So I'm trying to show you guys like what's going on. I thought I just heard a car. I thought I just heard a car. I'm going to shit my pants. I really like as scary as this place is. Never mind. I was gonna try to see some good in this, but there definitely is no good. Um, it's been a long time for me at the moment without Ben. I hope Ben's having it a lot easier than I am. Hopefully, he found like a nice little chair to sit on and has no problems. So, oh great, a fork in the road. Isn't that just phenomenal? A fork. Look at this. Ooh. What is that? It's full of boat. Hey, let me turn this off for a sec. Um, I'm going to keep this out here. What is this? It's literally like a little boat, guys. Look. We have a hippopotamus. Elephant. Yes, doggy. Dogecoin. Let me see. It's really hard to see, guys. It's so dark. I actually don't know what I'm looking at. All I see is a boat. Oh, gosh. Okay, this could be... No. I was going to say this could be Jesus, because we have been finding a lot of um, religious items in these... In this forest, but... What the hell? This is so cool. It's like a little boat. It's really, really neat. Another doge. Let's see right there, bud. Huh. Oh, oh gosh, it's gonna break. Oh. Let me get this off the road before someone runs this over. Oh, okay. Well, oh, there's that. Um, kind of neat. Not gonna lie. Have no idea what that signifies, but we got this gentleman here with this really, really nice beard, luscious beard. And there's that. So. Yeah. Okay. I want to get back to my car, bro. Alright, do I go left or do I go right? Wait a second. Yo, holy shit. Oh my god. We were here, bro. That's where the shoes are hung. Yeah. Look. The, the, the Nike Air Maxes, bro. Those are hung right there. Right there. I don't know what I'm saying anymore. There's a sock on the floor. 
Adidas slides, Fila slides, Crocs. I'm wearing mine as well. So, gosh, I don't know. I've been asking you guys what you what you think like this means when they're hung like on the tree like this. A lot of people mean like this is people marking their territory, or this is to show uh, respect to someone who's died in this general area. So it's nuts. It's just... Oh gosh, look, a lantern, bro. This is a battery operated lantern. Hold on. So that means someone was out here. Because Amish people don't use electricity. It's not working. Fuck. But this kind of does make sense because we came across someone with a uh, lantern the other day in the woods. This one's really clear. This, bro, this is recent. This is definitely. Well, it makes sense because I was literally here the other day. So. Whew, okay. Oh, sorry, guys. That was probably really loud. Um. Well, hot damn. I guess I could keep going in this direction. I mean, what are my options, really? Um, I came from that way about 20, 30 minutes. This way. I'm sure that if I eventually stay on the road, maybe I'll come across a car of some sort, a truck, preferably not a white one. <laughs> Um, and we could, uh, go from there. Let me switch to selfie mode quick. Okay. Um, what the hell is that? That sounds really odd. I'm probably the loudest person in the world, but it's probably good. It's probably good to be as loud as I possibly can. You know, it's a, what is that? But it sounds like metal. That sounds like a swing. Hello? What the fuck is that, bro? Yeah, please tell me you guys are hearing that. I really wish this place had a name. Well, it does have a name, but God, my hands are so cold. I'm gonna, my hands feel like my camera's gonna drop out of my hand any second. I'm just keeping an eye out, guys. I like to stay on guard, alert at all times because you literally just never know. Oh, I see something in the woods over there. What is that? What the shit was that, bro? What is that over there? I see something in the woods. It's freaking me out. Okay, look. Oh my god, what is that? Oh, hold on. It's really hard. What is that right there? Is that an animal? Oh no, what is that? Bro, what is that? Um, there's like some jelly material in there. I'm not a fan. All right, let me get back on road. I don't know why I'm going back into the woods again. Enough of that. Holy cow. Ugh. Like, the worst thing about this place is that, like, it's, like, 40 miles long, bro. So, like, if I ever want to get out, this is going to take me a while. I'm hearing a bunch of sounds. It's freaking me out. I thought I saw something down there. I really thought I just saw something down there. I fucking hope not. <laughs> um, oh, what was that? Don't know. Huh. 
trying to keep my composure, but in reality, I'm losing my mind right now. I'm trying not to show it to you guys on camera, but like, I'm genuinely scared. Bro, what is that behind me? Hello? What the fuck? I'm telling you, bro, I keep... S Hello? What is that sound over there, bro? So much weird shit going on in this forest. Hello? <sighs> what the f, f was that? Who's there? Who's there? I am armed. I am armed. Oh, the, the white thing in the grass scared the shit out of me again. Hello? I'm t- ah! oh, fuck. Oh, oh my god, bro! Yeah! Oh my god! Jesus, Ben! Sorry, I had to make sure it was you. I'm screaming on the top of my lungs! I'm losing my voice, bro! Oh, oh my god! Turn sideways though, the silhouette, I can see the camera. I was like, oh shit. First you have something to do with a flashlight. Thanks. Oh, okay. Welcome back. Holy fuck. Uh, Bro, yeah. what's going on here? <laughs> I don't fucking know. I just I've been walking for about 20 to 30 minutes from that direction over there. So I think we should probably just keep going over here. No, I think we should go home, bro. That's the plan, right? But if I came from over there and I came I'm going this way, I haven't checked this side yet. Where'd you come from? That way. And there's nothing over there. Yeah, I, I, well, I ran a lot and I went on a couple of different trails. So I don't really know what. I think our best bet's probably this way. Fuck it, yeah, I guess. All right, let's go. I'm turning the camera off. We've got strength in numbers now. Absolutely. Bro.